Welcome to this fantastic mini-series, Express Training. And today, Fishbone Diagram and the Five Whys. The benefits of using a Fishbone Diagram or the Five Whys is that it helps us accelerate the crystallization and understanding of some of the root causes that go into generating the problem that we're trying to solve. The fishbone diagram and the five whys work very well together. The fishbone is simple in concept really trying to identify the cause and the effect link. The effect being your problem statement. Put the problem statement at the head of the fish. Then on the bones of the fish put possible themes such as policies or people or infrastructure and then for each themed bone try and identify the possible causes such as a systems failure or too many approvals in the process etc and you can also drill deeper by asking why five times. For example, why do we have too many approvals? Because we don't trust the data. Why don't we trust the data? Because there are too many errors. Why do we have too many errors? Because we run reports at different times. It's as simple as that. In our how-to example, our problem is always having content missing from the forms. Then, theme by theme, we work through the different possible causes, such as no cross-checking, no instructions available, no ownership, no routing for approvals. It's great to do this with a team of people that are involved in your project. The story about cause and effect and the five whys. The statue of Abraham Lincoln in America is a popular tourist attraction. However, it had a problem. Despite the cleaner's best efforts, it was always dirty, because lots of pigeons also seemed to be attracted by it. So they called in pest control, who decided to place netting over the statue to stop the pigeons landing on it. However, this did not work. So they decided to catch the pigeons and take them far away. However, soon enough, the pigeons came back. So, they decided to ask a bird specialist why the pigeons kept coming. The bird specialist said it was obvious because of all the spiders. Pigeons love to eat spiders. So, the cleaner cleaned away the spiders. And for a while, the pigeons went away. However, soon they were back. Then, the cleaner asked himself why the spiders were there. And he realised because there were lots of flies at night. Why were there lots of flies at night? because the lights attracted them. So they turned the lights off. The flies went away, the spiders went away, and finally the pigeons went away as well. And all the cleaner was left to do was to clean up the mess left by the tourists. today's express training on fishbone diagram thank you very much for watching